Hi guys, I'm Jay. Welcome to Reflections. God's kingdom is like a farmer who planted some good seed in his field and that night went to sleep. And while him and his hired men were asleep, an enemy came and sowed thorns and thistles all through the wheat and then snuck away before dawn. When the first green shoots appeared and the grain began to form, form then the thistles and weeds showed up too. The farmhand came to the master and said, Master, that was clean seed you planted, wasn't it? Where did these thistles come from? And the master said, Some enemy's done this. And the farmhands asked, Should we go out and weed out the thistles? And he said, No, no, if you weed out the thistles, you'll pull up the wheat too. Let them grow together until harvest time. Then I'll instruct the harvesters to pull up the thistles and tie them in bundles for the fire. Then gather the wheat and put it in the barn. Another example is God's kingdom is like a pine nut that a farmer plants. It's tiny, small as seeds go, but in the course of years, it grows into a huge pine tree and eagles build their nests in it. Another example, God's kingdom is like yeast that a woman works into the dough for dozens of loaves and barley bread. That's what the kingdom of God is like. What does that mean to you today? What does that show you about the God's, God's kingdom all around you today? Let me know. I'm Jay. Speak to you later. Bye.